All right, Abraham, you've talked about this vortex. Esther's pointing her arms at this invisible stuff over here, and your voice gets louder and louder and happier and happier. You, you talk about this vortex of creation where everything you want is. Just tell me, how do I get my stuff out of the vortex and into the bank? How do I get it out here where I can see it? And then for a while, we said, go in there. Go in there where it is. Go in there where it is. Well, you just kind of freaked out over that. <laughs> you made imaginary doorways and walked through them. I'm in the vortex, you said. But none of you really believed the vortex, even though it is real. And we get it. You want to see it and hear it and smell it and taste it and touch it. You want to prove it through your own experience. And we want you to, too. In fact, that's why you're here in these physical bodies. You came to be on the leading edge where thoughts do turn to things. You came to materialize ideas. Your earth was once a swirling mass of vertexual stuff that you couldn't see. And now it's something that scientists see and understand and measure so much that was once only a thought is a physical reality that's what this is all about here this time space reality where you are the genius creators who now turn more thoughts to more things